Welcome back to the channel and thank you for visiting. On September 14th, Asus dropped a new update for a screen pad. And after that update, three things happened. First, my speaker stopped working, but a simple uninstall and reinstall of uh, Screen Expert app fixed that. Second was the apps for Sheet Expert, Doc Expert, and Slide Expert disappeared. And uh, so I'm thinking things are broken. So over a couple of days, I spent several hours online with Asus chat technicians and nobody could figure out what was going on. So finally one of them decided to send it up the chain. She sent me an email form to fill out explaining what the differences were, what the problems were, and to send those up. So I did. And those texts have been fairly responsive. Every couple of days they'll send me an email, let me know what's going on. So I got the final email today. It's not broken. The higher ups determined that there was not enough usage of Sheet Expert, Slide Expert, and Doc Expert. So they've removed them from ScreenPad so that they can use their resources for further enhancements and developments. So if Sheet Expert, Doc Expert, and Slide Expert are missing from your screen pad, it's not broken, that's by design. The second change is the icons that appear when you go to move windows between the main display and uh, the screen pad. So let's take a look at those new icons. Okay, so here's the new icon. You can send the display number one, the main display, display number two, the screen pad, and you have the three arrows. If you choose the left arrow, it will send it to the left side of the screen. If you choose the right arrow, it will take it to the right side. And if you choose the up arrow, it will explode it and put it over the whole display. And you can do the same thing with display number two or the screen pad. You can see from the new icons that there's no longer an option to save a window has a shortcut on the screen pad, but you can still create a shortcut for it. Let me show you how that works. So now I have several windows open up on the main display, and I would like to create a shortcut for Dymo Label Maker. So we go down here to screen pad, and I swipe to the left until I get to this last screen, and you will see icons for both the Dymo Label Maker and Excel. So you come over here to Dymo Label Maker and you click on that, red, on that white circle until you see a check mark. Now you can swipe to the right and you will see Dymo Label Maker now shows up as a shortcut on screen pad. So that is now how you add shortcuts to your screen pad. Okay, so those are the changes with the September 14th update. No more sheet expert, slide expert, doc expert apps, and you have new icons uh, for moving windows around on, uh, on your laptop. So, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. I hope you found something useful. And if you did, please like and share. You can leave some comments down below. On this side is a link to the original video, the unboxing and first view of the 532EQ. And on this side is a link for the subscription to the channel. Thank you again and hope to see you next time.